Top 5 MCQs of pneumonia MCQ number 1 is An elderly client with pneumonia may appear with which of the following symptoms first? Altered mental status and dehydration Fever and chills Hemoptasis and dyspnea Pleuritic chest pain and cough you can write your answer at the end of this presentation i will tell you the answer with rational mcq number 2 is which of the following would be an appropriate expected outcome for an elderly client recovering from bacterial pneumonia option a is respiratory rate of 20 to 30 breaths per minute Option B is the ability to perform ADL without dyspnea. Option C is a maximum loss of 5 to 10 pounds of body weight. And D is a chest pain that is minimized by splinting the rib cage. You can write your answers. MCQ number 3 is which of the following treatment would be expected for client with a spontaneous pneumothorax? Option A is antibiotics. Option B is bronchodilators. Option C is chest tube placement. Option D is hyperbaric chamber. Write your answers. MCQ number 4 is a 24 year old client come into the clinic complaining of right sided chest pain and shortness of breath. He reports that it started suddenly. The assessment should include which of the following interventions. Exaltation of breath sounds, chest x-ray, echocardiogram, electrocardiogram or ECG. Write your answer. MCQ number 5 is when exaltating the chest of client with pneumonia, which would expect to hear which of the following sounds over area of consolidations bronchial, bronchiovesicular, tubular, vesicular. Write your answers. Now we will uh, we will look at the answers with rationals. For MCQ number one is option correct option is A altered mental and status and dehydration. The rational is fever, chills, hypothesis, dyspnea, cough, and pleuritic chest pain are common symptoms of pneumonia. But elderly clients may first appear with only an altered mental status and dehydration due to blunt immune response. Answer of MCQ is the correct answer is option B. An expected outcome for a client recovering from pneumonia would be ability to perform ADLS without experiencing dyspnea. A respiratory rate 25 to 30 breaths per minute indicates the client is experiencing tachypnea which would not be expected on recovery. A weight loss of 5 to 10 pounds is undesirable. An expected outcome would be to maintain normal weight. A client who is recovering from pneumonia should experience decrease or no chest pain. Correct answer is C, chest tube placement for MCQ number 3. The only way to re-expand the lung is to place a chest tube on the right side of the ear in the pleural space can be removed and lung re-expand. Correct answer is option A, oxaltation of breath sounds for MCQ number 4. Because the client is short of breath, listening to breath sounds is a good idea. He may need a chest x-ray and ECG, but physician must order this test. Unless a cardiac source for the client pain is identified, he wouldn't need an need a echocardiogram. 
correct answer is option a bronchial for mcq number five chest exaltation reveals bronchial breath sounds over areas of consolidation bronchiovesicular are normal over middle mid lobe lung regions tubular sounds are commonly heard over large airways and vesicular breath, uh, breath sounds are commonly heard at base of the lungs so i hope that you have answered your all questions uh, now you should share your uh, your results in comments uh, thank you so much for watching please subscribe our channel for more videos